on this episode of Axe Girls. Some of the Axe Girls participated in the first ever UK vs US virtual team Axe Throwing Throwdown. Let's see who was victorious. This week we're going to meet one of our newest Axe Girls, Blood Tigress. She is out wandering Axe Girls. She's going to be traveling to some of the tournaments around the US and Canada. We cannot wait to hear where she checks in from each week. Battle Axe from Lethbridge, she competed in the Level Up Tournament. Let's take a look at some of that action. And we'll check in with the newly hitched Scratch. From Tamworth in the UK, Coggy and his team, the Fireblades, challenged the Axe Girls to a virtual throwdown. Using video chat, both teams played virtually head to head for the win. Let's see how that played out. So we're just going to draw random names, right? Danny's our uh, team captain of Fireblades. Okay. All right. So he's around still, so he's going to come here now and appear. Hello. Sorry about that. <laughs> Who's going to pick a name for me? All right, we're going to pick a name. No, I'll be right, my so the winner is... we got Boneless for the first one. Boneless versus... Ah, oh, I fucking pick my Neck. name. <laughs> Raven. Needs, she can't, needs. Raven. More. You're More playing Raven. Raven. You got Boneless on the left and more on the right lane, right? That's correct. Perfect. So do we have to call the kill, uh, Clutch? Yes. So and that's on the fifth row. Right before, yeah, exactly. Are you guys ready? Hey, okay, tap out, guys. They tapped as well. All right. Sink it. More is calling it boneless, won't. Okay. Because <laughs> he's boneless. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, that, I'll call it. That's a six. That's a six. Leon's six. calling you a six. Six. Thanks, Leon. Right. Thanks, Leon. Yeah. Boneless and Madcap. What was the uh, scores? The final score? Yep, Eight please. To four. And then Moore and Raven? Seven to five. So, well done, guys. Well done, guys. Well done, guys. That's Axel. Awesome. Axel. 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 <laughs> okay. All right. Who am I playing? So, you're playing Coops. Yeah. Naughty. Naughty. It has to be naughty, otherwise it's cat. Right. You got. So you got naughty. You are playing naughty. animal. You guys ready? Yeah. We're ready. We're ready. Yeah. Our guys are ready. Sure. Tap in. <laughs> Hey 
guys. So what was the score on that? So the total of Axel has seven points, Poop has five points, so, Marty has three, and Animal has nine. Well done, Axel. Well done. You gotta Good have match. Cat against someone over there. Okay, Cat. You're going against. Are you seriously joking with me? <laughs> I mean, come on. Yes. <laughs> oh, yes. Top in, guys. Let's do this. All right. Good luck, Cat. You got this. I've got Punisher. I've got Axel. <laughs> Axel, Punisher. Yeah. Okay, guys. Yeah. Yes, okay. Put them up now. Yeah. Okay, all right. Yeah, Carl's, Carl's now going to be on, so Punisher and Carl. Yeah. Carl. Versus. Carl. Yeah. Carl. Carl. You get us ready? We're ready. We're ready. No, I was talking to these girls. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, they're ready. All right, they're clinking. This is so great. <laughs> Guys are calling. Yeah, yeah. so of ours. Good. Oh. No. 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 I can see it from here. Yeah. <laughs> Nothing here. No. Nothing here. Nothing here. <laughs> Oh, do you know what that means, don't you? Second place. <laughs> Second place. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> First runner up. <laughs> so you guys send a t shirt signed by your players to go on our wall as a trophy. You oh, what? what yeah, you got to do that. All right. All right. I see you, you in my Bye. Hey everybody, uh, Blood Tigers here. I'm gonna throw some trick shots. What up? I'm a loving mother of two, Abby and Alex. I'm from Sudbury, Ontario, Canada. One night I was online app with two of my friends and one of my friends said, well, I'm an ax thrower. I'm like, an ax thrower, really? And he's like, well, would you consider working in ax throwing? I said, Hell, why not? <laughs> and I had a blast. And practice and practice and practice. I just loved it. I've been coaching for two and a half years now. I've won two leagues. And my dad calls me Davy Crockett. <laughs> I'm the first female 
two-time champion in Northern Ontario. I have exciting news. I'm going to be going to throw in Ohio this year. So July 29th to August 1st, I'll be competing in Hatchet. I'm pretty excited about this. Um, I'm hoping to do well and see how far I can go to be an inspiration to other women and to other throwers in our community. Thank you. Much love.
Battleaxe. This is Ryan with Warriors uh, Asteroid. We are both here at the Level Up Tournament. We are both out, but we are both pretty happy with how we did. We both did two and two? Two and two. Two and two. Yeah. I got an opportunity to talk with Ryan here, our sponsor, which we're really thrilled and very, very grateful for and super stoked. Oh, we're pumped too. We're super pumped. <laughs> Can't wait to throw and thank you so much to get Ryan. Oh, and no worries. We're super happy to be a part of it. We're super happy. We're going to send some uh, some axes down south. Sweet. And uh, yeah, we'll send some gear and uh, yeah, I just love what you guys are doing. It's awesome. Thank you. I yeah. think it's a great opportunity. It's so great you can join up and well, I'm really the pumped love. about it. I'm just really pumped about it because it's, I think, this kind of stuff that really builds the community and keeps really yeah. where the roots came from, the, the, the people, the community, and mm -hmm. uh, sometimes the throwing is just really secondary to how awesome these people are. Absolutely. Yeah. Make new friends and, oh, and yeah. strangers and you don't even think twice about, you know, their family. Yeah, and I can't tell you how many times like, like I've gotten, it's like, oh wow, it's so nice to actually meet you in person now because we talk with so many people all over the internet and all yeah. over the world. and. It's sometimes with the last couple of years been rare to actually, you know, meet people yes. face to face. So it's been awesome. And I'd like to thank Ryan. He just gave me this awesome access roll. Can't wait. So nice. So great. Yes, absolutely. I <laughs> so love I have it. to high five that. Yeah. <laughs> this is Goose from 81 Axes. They are great hosts for the Level Up tournament today. How did you feel it went today? I am absolutely blown away by the love and support that this it I don't even have the words it's this is amazing it it um I'm in this community for a reason and it's not for access it's because of the people and today just cemented on cement how amazing everybody is. And this is my home and I have a vision for it. And everybody here today supports that wholeheartedly. And it, it melts my heart. So it is, like I say, the, the axes bring us together, but it, it, the axes quickly become secondary. It, yep. it, without question. Absolutely. And it's, it's about the fam. And, yep. and it's it's just like I said, it, it melts my heart every day, and that's it's one of the things that keeps me going. So awesome! Yeah. Well, not only did <laughs> Goose set this all up for us, he also built axes as well. And I forgot mine in my bag. And that's okay. I have it it's here. I'll show it to you guys another Amy, day. <laughs> Amy's got a nice custom. She was a uh, a prototype tester, and it's a good design. So because I want you to hit that clutch. I want you to hit that nobly pole. I want that big ax. Let's go. <laughs> Last official match we played, you handed my ass to me. So it works. Can I learn from the best? <laughs> no, not the best, but I'll take it. Or what of, but, yeah, thank you. But you know, you have been a mentor and you have everything you do for us. It has meant a lot and the ax you met, made for us means a lot. I should explain my ax that Goose made. Um, it was a very special piece for me. It had, the rose that I carved yes. into it. So my grandmother two years That's ago close. was really sick and she's we got into axe throwing and supported my husband marksman and i helped you in a tough time helped us in a tough time she couldn't come to any games or anything so we'd videotape it and show her and she always rooted me on and she loved pink roses and purple is my That's favorite color and we wanted something that we could mem remember her by and tie the support that she gave us together so goose made so i did the purple heart yeah, with the pink rose with the pink rose and uh walnut I absolutely love it so much and I don't throw it often only because I love it so much and I don't want anything to happen to it. It has to do about this mm -hmm. heart in this woman. <laughs> it's all we can ask for. That's I right. mean, if, if the world was more like this, the world would not have so oh, we, many problems. We've got <laughs> you too because you make the world a better place, Goose. Thank you, Amy. Thank you so much for everything and for doing absolutely. this and your support. You are family and I you always have your back. So. Yeah. Thank you. You're awesome. You did a great job today. Thank you. Thank you, 81 Access, for hosting us and for a great day. Mm -hmm. See you guys. Hi, it's Scratch. So on the last episode, I mentioned that I was getting married and I did to Carl, who is here. Hi. Ta da. <laughs> yeah, we did have a big thing planned for the summer. However, we still have COVID restrictions here in the UK. So we just did the small ceremony with our immediate family, which was really nice. We 
had the sun and um, we went for some drinks and some food afterwards um, and just had a really nice day. Um, we went away for the weekend following to a theme park and another axe throwing venue in the UK, um, obviously. Um, it was really good fun. However, uh, we're really looking forward to next year as we're going to do it all again, have a big party and then we're going on our honeymoon. Um, so first seven nights we're going to do a couple of states in America and then for the next seven nights we're going to Cancun. Um, so really looking forward to that and hoping to visit a few different Axe Loan venues and hopefully some of the other Axe Girls um, when we're over in the States.